to No Fun and Friends YouTube channel. First of all, we would like to thank to all our subscribers and likes for our last ASL Blindfold Challenge and Pasaya Eye Battle. And for today's vlog, we are going to talk about the economic issue in the Philippines and its unhealthy growth and productivity and its reason. 108,307,717 Filipino population and 5.2% of this belong to the bottom of the society. This aspect or stage of life makes our economic and healthy of growth because of unhealthy living cause of the given issue. And now, to make the issue reliable or justify in that way, we are going to ask random questions individual which having a different levels of professionalism. So let's start! Regarding to our economic issue here in the Philippines, by the way, I'm Zell and my partner Brad. So Ma, Boy Ma, what are the causes why our economy here in the Philippines is going slowly? Okay. But for me, um, first is the lack of education. Second is um, profitability. Next is the uh, unemployment. Next is uh, population growth. And that's how we understand that. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you for that important answer, ma'am, for our research. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. So according to a stranger we interviewed a while ago, the main cause why the Philippine economy is growing slowly is because of lack of education. Because education gives knowledge and skills to the workers. And workers are the both determinant in business and economic growth. If we have lack of education, it can cause an unemployment and we cannot help in our economic growth. Partner, we're done interviewing a stranger, so we will proceed to our plot twist. So subscribers, here is the plot twist of this video. Our friends, Money Naps and Pino Hacks, doesn't know that they are going to pick a question and they must answer it impromptu. Oh, excited to partner. Let's go. So let's go. Show. So let's call on a hardworking student, Mr. So we have a question for you. What? Pick, just pick one. Oh my god. I never expect <laughs> this. So oh. here's your question. What is your thought and opinion about the given issue? Oh my god. What is my thought and opinion about this given issue? Okay, first and foremost, um, our issue is about unemployment, education, poverty, and hunger. So, if the country is given with an unhealthy economy, the individual that living there is unproduct uh, unproductivity only. So, for me, as an individual, must do an action which is to promote the education and strengthen it for the threatened future. And I, thank you. Thank you very much. Let's call on a Dalaga Filipina na Mako, Jessica Soho! Hi friend! Oh. So we have a question for you, just pick one. So, as a student, what can you suggest to prevent poverty or end poverty? Um, on my own opinion, we, we need to finish our studies. And also, we need to have a stable job so that we, we can provide our daily needs. Thank you very much for that So next, let's call on a million sperm survivor ng Mago, Emerson Nelson. 
Uy, pre! Don't mean I'm changed. Are you a gay? Because of you. Oh my god. So, pre, we have a question for you. Just pick one. In the given issues, what is your recommendation to conquer it? For me, I students, I will use my vocal as vehicle to media, a free education and training. Thank you so much. Are you? Uh, yes. Thank you so much. So next, let's welcome ang tagapagmana ng Silibuta, Red Ears. So welcome to Planet Earth, Mr. Kibbs. Thank you. Here is your question. Just pick one. Here is your question. How can you prevent the lack of education so that economy grow faster? To prevent the lack of education so that the economy grows fast, first, expand access of high-quality early childhood education programs, and last, is improve and expand school-based early warnings. Thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. I love you. So next, let's call on the NCSP ng Anika Home, Daisy the Virgin. Wow! Here is your question. Just pick one. Why is education important for economic growth? Okay, for me, education is sense is one of the fundamental factors of development. No country can achieve sustainable economic development without substantial investment in human capital. Education enriches people's understanding of themselves and world. It improves the quality of their their lives and leads to broad social benefits to individual and society. Education, education raises people productivity and creativity and promotes entrepreneurship and technological advances. In addition, it plays a very crucial role in securing economic and social progress, improving income distribution, and I thank you. Are you done? Yes. Thank you for that very long answer. <laughs> so our next friend, she is a Binibining Purok Di Makita 2010, Binibining Barangay Matulis 2011, Mutia ng Santo Tomas 2012, Binibining Dovnor 2013, Binibining Pilipinas Universe 2014, and Miss Universe 2015. Let's welcome none other than Ruth Sisa! Hi friends! Hello Rev! So here's your question. What will be the causes if a person is lack of education? Lack of education has, has been an issue in our society. Such as poor health and nutrition deficiency among people due to illiteracy. Lack of education can cause gender inequality, lack, lack of skills in labor, and less productivity in, in scene. Last is lack of, lack of opportunity as people is in ignorance. Hence, lifestyle is no. Oh, thank you. So partner, may we call on again our friends? yourself again. Hi, I'm Nan. Hello, I'm Jess. I'm Ruth. I'm Sai. I'm Sun. And I'm Ren. And I am Zell. And I'm Franz. So and we are No Fun and Friends. Thank you. Bye. 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 We're going to Moy. <laughs> A few moments later. Our plan that we're going to Robinson is mission abort. <laughs> <laughs>